One of the best ways to begin designing a new space is to create a mood board. This is Rachel from Maison de Pax, and I'm here today to tell you how you can create beautiful design boards using nothing but free online tools. For today's video, I'm going to walk you step-by-step -step through creating a mood board or a laundry room. First, I always use Pinterest to gather my inspiration for any room. I save pins to specific boards so I can see all my ideas for a single space in one place. Next, I begin searching out the design elements of my inspiration. I start by creating a folder to hold my images. In this case, I'm titling it Laundry Mood Board. For this room, I'm starting with the black and white Harlequin tiled floors. I Google my search term, then click over to Images. Note, many of these images are copyrighted, so please remember that mood boards like this should be for personal reference only. When I find an image that represents what I like, I save the image to my Laundry Mood Board folder. I then continue to search Google Images for the other elements of the room, especially those that I won't be purchasing as a single product. For example, flooring, wall color, and in this case, the washer and dryer I already own. Next, I begin searching actual products I may want to use in the space, like lighting, artwork, and cabinet hardware. In each case, I save the image to the same laundry mood board folder. Now comes the magic. Open up a Google Slide document. You can create one by going to docs.google.com and choosing a new presentation. You can also do this in a Word document, but I like how easy it is to manipulate the images on Google Slides. I like to use a background I've created for my slides since I often create these for clients as well, but you can use whatever plain background you prefer. Now, choose Insert, Image, Upload from Computer. Choose one or more of the images you saved for your mood board. At this point, you can resize, crop, and spin the image if a different size or orientation is better. Continue to upload the images and resize them to your liking. If needed, you can arrange the images front to back on the slide so that the image makes the most sense. One thing I also like to do, especially if I like how the materials are coming together, is to link the images to the products I found. As I mentioned, some of these things are not products I will be purchasing, such as the cabinetry and beadboard, which I already have in the space. But the ones that I will need to order to complete the look can be linked directly in the slide to the product so that I have it all in one place when I am ready to purchase. I hope you enjoyed seeing this come together. This same system can be used to visualize the design for any space, interior or exterior, and provides a wonderful starting point for any design. For more decorating and design ideas, subscribe and visit MaisonDePax.com.